so this is a dragonfly that just hopped on my knee I'm actually in the garden no, he hopped on another knee I'm in the park at the back of my house and this is the part I always go to that has a river the small stream natural stuff and yeah we have a dragonfly here I think this is an angel this is actually the first time that I have a dragonfly on my knee see what he's doing isn't this awesome because today we just finished a radio show and in the radio show we did a lot of heart sutra meditation um, connecting to the heart energy connecting to the higher self we did the Om Vajra Satnaham and I think this is, I don't know, usually usually dragonflies don't even come so close to me but I think I'm so pure ever since today this morning and my energy is super clean that's why we attract these beautiful beautiful very beautiful elegant Dragonfly. You see how beautiful she is? Yeah, there you go. I kind of zoom in. So let's see, what does she want to say? Orion. Oh my god, is this Orion? Are you Orion? Flap your wings if you're Orion. Hey, she, she moved her wings down. You saw that, right? Um, okay, Orion, can you look at me? Oh, see? He put his hands up. Haha, <laughs> we're talking to a dragonfly. Okay, so what do you want? To, what message do you want to send? This is the first time I'm talking to the Orion galaxy, I guess. Ladies, Orion. Orion says that Mazi must not forget to see the meteor shower tonight. Um... There's a meteor shower tonight that Mazi must see and oh my god. So they are coming in tonight. So where am I supposed to go? Never mind, just blow. Orion and Gulad, what do you want to say? The They wanna get in touch with their baby children, starseed children. Orion There is They're saying that there are engineers or creative there are builders there are builders who needs to wake up a lot of the people needs to start building things Orions are builders they build they build um, they build families or they build this they say have to start building from now the message is to start building from now you see Start building what you want from now because the proceeds and the 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 rewards are about to really really pop up within these three months by December this year by 21st December this 2013 it will be another new phase because it's a one-year cycle of release of advancement of growth there's a lot of um, release there's a lot of gain there's a lot oh there's a bumblebee that just died you see that bumblebee there's a bumblebee that just died and I wanna put well we can't do the chem different chem I think we can, no we can't. But you can see me in this 
still here. This is the first time I get to actually have a very beautiful loving dragonfly just set on me. Okay, I think if you want to see how I look like, so I look like this. I'm going out to gym after and I'm going to go and sign up for a swimming class because I always wanted to know how to swim but I never could so it's a good day for me because we're going to learn something new oh yeah that's what they mean by build something that you love I think they mean by build yourself so yeah we are building ourselves um they say Orion says that we need to build ourselves starting from now because our release for, for different people have different stages but for the people who have really so much and who has come to a more balanced neutral position where you are uh, allowing yourself to take to accept the energies to ad better advance yourself these um, energy is going to help you build your future so they say build your future from the choices you make now whatever you wish to accomplish make a plan whatever you wish to accomplish make a plan and make a plan and make a plan and flow with your heart there is no more time to keep listening to the doubts to the expectations to the rules of the mind there is no ifs or buts or excuses to do what you do the mind is has been the master of your life but now you have to allow your heart to be the master of your life because the heart is the star core energy the heart is the energy where oh, is the energy where where you are going to allow yourself to redeem, revive, reignite, spark. To allow yourself to be the full capacity of love. And this is by tuning into your heart instead of your mind. I mean, look at this. I still have listen to your heart, ignore everything else. It's fading out. But yeah, this is listen to your heart and ignore everything else. This is what you're saying. The Orions are saying, build, 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 and build. Build yourself. This is the time where you are transforming to the positive changes of the world, of your world, your universe. Lots of visitations here. Haha, <laughs> he went in the middle of there. Um, so... What do you want to become in life? Who do you inspire to be? What are your hobbies? What are your energies where you feel great? You don't have any limits. Stop putting limits on yourself. Um, feel the... Okay, they're, they're like hovering. I think they're healing my feet. Can you believe it? There's even a snail. Oh, now he wants to go away come back <laughs> I think we have a favorite pet right now and this pet is the dragonfly in a I don't know what kind of position it's kind of hot right now we have the Sun there where is the Sun yeah that's the Sun Ugh. that's the Sun and we have the clouds can barely see hey look the cloud looks like a thumbs up <laughs> and then we have other clouds and some little and some trees and the dragonfly is still here but you know what there's actually a snail on my the base of my feet can you see there's a snail okay anyway um yeah what else are they trying to say and now there's two dragonflies two dragonflies but only one is hopping on me um okay so what else oh the last time i was here i met two squirrels i met a lot of monkeys i mean this is the first last time was the first time i met two squirrels who said hello 
it's really it was so cool. And then I didn't want to bring my iPhone because I thought that I wouldn't need to record anything. But then someone beat me something and then I'm like, oh, okay, I will just bring my iPhone. So, and then so lucky that I brought my iPhone because the dragonfly just hopped on me right now. I mean, literally, as I sat down, he just arrived. I mean, they were expecting me. Because earlier this morning, they were, um, the Orions were in my room and then they were talking to me. But I didn't really get them. So... Okay, what else do they want to say? Um, they say that... Accept that you have the strength to change. Accept that you have, you can achieve the things that you want to achieve. Whatever that you want, it is possible because your mind is no longer putting limitations on your body. Your mind is no longer putting any limitations on your, on your, on your heart. Your mind is not controlling your heart. That's it. And your heart can accomplish so many great things because, um, once you tune into the best possible result of who you are, you are embracing your divine universe to becoming one with everything, and whatever you desire will be, will be, will be super, super, super manifested. So right now, and then they were telling me about these three months. So these three months, you will be actually be very, very active. The lion's roar, which is Leo, the Leo energy right now is creating a lot of and. Um, they are creating a lot of a lot of these um, roaring the fighting energy creating a lot of fighting energy so this fighting energy is like allowing people to fight for what they believe in because there is no longer being nice to energy vampires or the universe that um, is forced upon you there's no longer that thing because you understand now that there is no choice but to fight for what you want to live for. You have to fight for what you have to um, be grateful or be happy or be uh, joyous. And the things that you want, you desire that is good for your divine life, sometimes, most times, actually we have to fight for it because of all the extraterrestrial energy, uh, not extraterrestrial energy, more to the, um, the energies that doesn't fit your universe is blocking your pathway to your divine living of consciousness so it's so hot right now i think that's about it there's like two snails on my feet right now if you can see there's one here and there's one there somewhere and there's this beautiful baby here so it's been 30 minutes. They want me to sing. Okay, I will try and remember the song. We are one today. We are one forever. We are the vision to love and unite. We are. We are. Da 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 da. See, Orion doesn't like me because I forgot the song. Damn. Um. So. Yeah, I'll put this song. I'll, I'll sing this song over this, so. Let's just move. We are one today. We are one forever. We are the vision to love and unite. We will follow your love and light. We are one. We are peace. We will find love The sons, the daughters of Adam and Eve The love from source of love and peace Light up all the universe We are one that holds the light Gather all the beings From all corners of galaxies we unite to become one we are love and light from source of god down trail in the path of life we will sing and shine the light we are the new warriors we will sing with might our voice will speak the truth we will shake the world 
Change will happen with our existence. We are the warriors of life. How do you stop this thing? Everything. Um, I'll keep in touch with you via Facebook. My name is Mazin Mainrus, and I'm a soul coach and universal healer. And we have a visitor, which is the Orion people here. Yeah, you can see um, fishes in the stream, a group of it. Say goodbye to the people here. There's a lot of spiritual energy here, a lot of archangels, a lot of the, a lot of dragonflies, which are Lyra's, or this is the Orion family channeling to me. And that's quite it. Goodbye. Say goodbye. Flap, flap your wings. Hey, I was sitting down and still at the same spot where I am at the small stream in the park behind my house. So, they show me this. This is, um, I don't know what that is, but it looks interesting. See, like, is this usually this kind of plants holds a little bit of an angel? I mean, a fairy realm, realm things. There's there's something in be in there. That looks like a something. You know, they asked me to pick it up or just to dab on it, but I'm not too sure, so I'm just gonna like move it a bit. Oh, it's water. It's water with some. Look, it's water. What kind of water is this? Because it doesn't. This water is not normal water. They asked me to pick it up. What should I do? Well, let me just... Is this really water or is it like a gem elixir? What do you guys think? Okay, they say that... Imagine you have to drink it. Oh my god, I have to drink it. Seriously, I have to drink it? What is this? A lot of people... <laughs> There's no people here in, at the park, so that's cool. They asked me to drink it. Ah! Oh shit. It fell. See? Too bad for me. But it's okay. I think I got it. Yeah, it's here. It's on this leaf here. This wet leaf here. So. I put it on the bottom of my lips. That was cool. How it was like a... How it was like a... How it was like a... You know? A ball, a drop of liquid that doesn't want to disperse. Um, yeah, I'm still here. Just finished my meditation. Like a quiet, silent, peaceful meditation. Um, maybe do you want to talk some more or something? They say, we love you, you're always around, we're gonna take care of you, as much as you don't realize that we're around, we have always been around, all of us, not just Orion, Lyra's, Andromeda's, Vega's, Syrians, all the Starseed families have been watching you from afar, yes, I know that this is true because they told me this before. Whenever you need help, just ask for it and have faith, open up your yourself to receive the help. I see um fish. Can you see some fish? They have little small fishes here. There he is again. The Orion babies. Eh, he's there. Anyway, yeah I'm going to go and get my swimming lesson started out. And money just came in. A lot of people <laughs> there was like three different people who asked me within this 24 hours there was three different people who talked to me about my lip balms that I make on um, it was just natural and it's been I haven't been doing it for eight months and people are asking me Ma, like you want to buy your lip balms are you still selling them and I said yeah yeah of course and then um, yeah there's this lady who just out of nowhere just texted me she said hey I want to get your lip balm do you still sell them and I said yeah and it was just on the way here and I just replied her 
and that was um, yesterday I went to boot camp one of my um, a rebel boot camp in, 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 in my area and the guy who met me in my markets in the mall before asked me hey your lip balm is so good like it's like better than the commercial one so he said he wants to order two so yeah it was good and then the other one was that someone in US or oh, even even Reina does re wants my lip balm because she loves the minty melon minty melon vanilla um, minty melon and vanilla is my top two um, very um, very best-selling ones so any of you who wants some lip balms you can get it from me um, you can go to minusimperium.com or you can just say on Andromeda love story hey I want your lip balm um, send it to this country or whatever and then you can make payment and then I'll just post it up right off to you it's really good anyway um, the lip balms are what made me started doing these healing things so thanks to all the lip balms it's awesome um, yeah lip balm is my first gateway to doing healings because I heal lips I heal lips <laughs> it's really good I love what I do I hope all of uh, all of you are doing what you do if you're not yet um yeah just focus on finding a way like focus on accepting signs and um, accepting pathways and guidance to get where you want and wish to be speak to your heart and you'll find a way always speak to your heart I have the radio show that I did on Andromeda Love Story Block Talk Radio. It's called the Andromeda Number Eight, Hash Eight. Andromeda Love Story Hash Eight. It talks about this heart energy that you can connect to, um, and it was like a one hour long plus. So go and listen to it, and it's gonna be good. See ya. This is Maju Minus for Andromeda Love Story, and you get the view of everything. Bye. Hey everyone, I'm just walking back to my car. I just realized, do you know that thing, the the small droplet of bead water light form that doesn't disperse on the on the um, on the little leaf plant thing that I said about. Um, usually there's um, elemental fairies kingdom around there. I just realized, you know how it dropped, and I thought they told me to eat it or put it in my lips, and you know. I, my previous video that I recorded just re just now we was talking about my lip balm so do you know how relevant this is that the angelic kingdom the fairy kingdom actually talks about like give me signs physical signs as in oops I put it on my lips the small droplet and then I talk about my lip balm so to all of you who want the lip balms I don't know if you can see I didn't put some on today but I always put it on um, when I have chapped lips and it, it always goes like always moisturize immediately so yeah thank you everyone I'll see you bye go and check out Andromeda love story and say hello I would love to hear from you this is the park in Kuala Lumpur Malaysia Taman Tun Dr. Ismail bye, -bye.